Hi everybody, this is Kefren, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm gonna do a dedicated video for Elgato product and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna fix your issue if you have an issue with the product. So first of all, I wanna mention with Elgato product, you have a couple of different software and you can update this software if you want. The thing is, you also have a firmware inside of your product. So if you have the camera, if you have like the key lights or whatever the product that you have, but they don't show to you inside of the software. Uh, so you need to unlock it to do a firmware update. And they do a lot of fixing their firmware update. I had an issue with my camera. I fixed that with the firmware. Same thing with my HD60X and same thing with my key lights. And the way that I uh, heard about it, it's when I contact their support, they told me how to do it. So I want to share it with you guys. So for, for an example, you have some stability issue, stability issue with your Wi-Fi and your key light. They always disconnect. You don't know why. I'm going to show you how to do that. So you open your control center. And if you click on the setting of, for an example, your Elgato key light here, you see that you have a firmware ver version, but you don't have any button to update it. So I'm going to click X. If you hold control on your keyboard and you click on it, left click. Now you see that you have an update firmware. You click on it and you do the update. By default, I think mine was 1.0.1. .1, and uh, when I did that for the latest version, it fixed all my issue with the light. So another one that I can show you, it's the camera. I had a lot of issue, like some random stuttering when I bought it. So if you click setting over there, as you can see, you have a firmware uh, version. Again, I have the latest one. You have to hold control, left click on it. And now you have the update firmware that will appear. You click on it and you do your update. Pretty much the same thing with the 4K utility. If you go to setting device, you will have a firmware version. No button over there. If you hold control, left click. Now, now you have the update firmware that you can press on it and make sure that you have the latest version. As I said before, it fixed all my issue with all of the Elgato product. I don't know why they don't give the option to the, the customer. It's a bit weird for me. Very important when you do the update, don't reset your computer, unplug the, the hardware that you update. You don't want to break your item and after that it will not work. So make sure that the old process is finished. But it honestly, it's working well and you will improve the performance and the uh, stability of your product. If you have any question about it, just come in the YouTube section, post me uh, the item that you have from Elgato, uh, the system that you're using. I will try to help you the best that I can. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Peace.